Hey, hey everybody, we're back. Here's Bev and Lydia and we're gonna walk around, okay? So I realized, from whatever y'all said, that I'm dumb and did not start you guys at Best of Show. So here's Best of Show 2019. Now what's really cool about this quilt is it's a bee quilt. So Leanne uh, Chahaley submitted it that it was made by her whole guild or uh, bee that was all over the world. So cool. Shall we just walk the ribbons, ladies? Does that sound fun? Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry it took me so long to come back, guys. I had to charge my phone because it died. All right, Best of Machine Quilting, Burst by Marge Tucker. Just speak up loudly so we can hear you. <laughs> Vicky! I got my phone charged, Vicky. Say hi as you guys hop back on. Hey, Sue! And this is um, Framed Machine Quilting, so uh, The Modern Junk by Judy Robinson. And then I guess I have to go the other way because they split these. Look at all those heavens. I know, right? How amazing is this? Fancy Joe! Gina! Oh, hey, Hubster! Hubster's watching, guys! I love it. Uh, the right across the middle. I know. There's a, a lot of them that I feel like did not get fully steamed out. That I'm like, why, why did we not steam that? All right, let's go. Hey Debbie, hey Suzanne, hey Colette, hey Linda. There it is again. Best of show again. Continue. I love the colors, guys. I'm it's so, so bright. Aren't the colors this year great? This is neat too. This is very neat. This is Waterfall by Sarah J. Lawson from Orlando. Hey Peggy. And it's a quilting award. Hmm? Yes, it is. The Handy Quilter Excellence Award. This is the raffle quilt this year. Keyhole Kaleidoscope. How cool is that? So all of this in the middle is the special exhibit from Sherry Lynn. I'm gonna help me. Wood. Wood, thank you. I'm like, I got two out of three. Sherry Lynn Wood. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna I'm gonna pick up where I kinda left off with you guys. No, I had to stop take a picture of this. The of Sun Cake? You you recognize that pattern, don't you? That's my rug. This one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Is this this transparency? Negative. This is first place in use of negative space because, guys, look. It's thread. Oh, <laughs> it's not like a whole cloth? Quilt? No, these, there's a few little pieced doodads. But then the rest of it is. So that is uh, Complementary Convergence by Cassandra Beaver. Over here. Look at this. Hey, Ruth. Hey, Kathleen. Guys, this is so crazy. Look at this. Let's just go ahead and establish that I'm not this patient. And I'm so glad she is. All right, in second place is Herman and the Dingbats by Rebecca Bell. I'm going to go on around this way because that's where I left. Oh, wait, no, I'm not because I need to show this. Because third place is so beautiful. Look at this. Um, Lucy in the Sky by Elaine Davis. <laughs> Vicky. Oh, hey, Doc. All right, we'll keep on going. Um, fringe area by Heather Black. The purple. I, the purple, purple. Look at, and I love that yellow with it because those are what, ladies? Complimentary color. Complimentary color. Bev gets the prize today. <laughs> 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 Do you like how I just quizzed you, like publicly? <laughs> oh, Finite Struggle, Infinite Hope by Sarah Maxwell. Oh, this is very cool. She's a designer. She is. She's in the booth next to Orville. Yeah. I've been like waving at her all week. Look at this. That's awesome. I love it so mm -hmm. much. The different colors. There. Yeah, that's really neat. And it's rainbow so order good. too. Uh huh. They are. I like Ooh, I like too. this. This is Found at Low Tide by Julie Smith. Oh, thanks, Doc. Doc, you've been watching my QuiltCon lives for a while now. Look how fabulous. I like this one, too. Ooh, have we seen this one yet? Oh, all space. right. Where are all the black women by Jessica Wall? Ooh, look at how they did the lettering, guys. Oh, wow. So sharp. And then look as I get closer. Look at this. Oh, I love it. 
more eyelid. So stunning. Place. Ooh, and this quilting, guys. That's Ooh. Life by Mary Landon. <laughs> I love it a lot. I love it so much, guys. I love how they created the, ex the different shapes of the quilting. Right? Ooh. It's such a great division like, of all triangle. that space. So Look at this. I need. I want to learn how to do that. I haven't really dabbled into this yet, but I want to badly. Look at that, guys. The, the oh, like creating oh. shapes by not quilting them. I haven't done a whole lot of that. I've done a Look little at this bit. One. Look at this one. I know with the little, like little paisleys. paisleys and and there's also like McTavishing right there. A little bit. Yep. Oh, I love it so much. And here's switchbacks. We've had some really interesting use of switchbacks in the show. And here's the continuous. We've been about. The continuous, continuous curves, curves, making that orange peel. That's also, so please gorgeous. note the navy in this quilt. The navy, the excellent use of navy <laughs> in this quilt. <laughs> <laughs> Strong by Stephanie Rule. Y'all didn't think I could razz Lydia anymore. I saw that I did these earlier. Great? Yeah, so beautiful. It's neat too. <laughs> Lydia, you thought I couldn't possibly get any rougher on you. Jeez. Color Glide Summer by Julie Smith. Look at this. this really mm. Can it look like summer now, please? What? Purple. There's a little bit of lavender <laughs> and also some orange. <laughs> Let's see. We did. This was the incidental pickle that we did earlier, guys. Okay, I'm going to head on down to where I left off earlier. Aren't they amazing? These like youth quilts were very thoughtful here i'll just do a quick oh, yes, tan as we walk by guys i just i that feel like these kids are thinking about things i was not thinking about at their age just, just let's just put it that way yeah their courage unbelievable okay here we go piecing purple look at this orange. lovely use of purple purple haze oh, by daniel Ella O'Connor. <gasps> my dad and, would like that that's the shade this, of orange his i know look color. at these lovely little hashes and that's that are in a here. Solid color no, there's a little the bit of orange mm -hmm. has the, the lighter purple, and the one purple. of the lighter purple. Mm -hmm. the, the, the print, print accent is very mm -hmm. common this year. Of like lots of solids and then a little bit. Of, you can see it here too, guys. The, the solid, but then there's just a couple little stripes in there. This is I would be art by Tara Glastonbury. Oh yeah, you gotta do Vader. Oh yeah, we'll turn around and get Vader. Fear not. <laughs> Okay, Vader by Angela Bowman. It's just so like big and bold. It is. Okay. I mean, when you look at it, too, there's not. And yet it's just simple process. It, it, yeah, the it very is. simple. It's <laughs> so hard not to. Yeah. <laughs> Unfinished Conversations by Beth Markle. Look at, Your I know, th 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 I feel like this is probably what Lydia's looks like too, based on I love the yellow. Her, really? Because you've worn yellow both days so far. I was just assuming I know, you I really just, love I yellow. Discovered. You discovered the yellow? Because it looks really great. Look at this, guys. This is so beautiful. Brown hair, yeah. Just don't put it on me. The, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we get Grello Bev very, very quickly. Ooh, the metallic. Ooh. Okay, this is Strip Quilt by Tara Fawn. We've established that Bev should not wear yellow. <laughs> but that's okay for Lydia, too. But Lydia can wear yellow. <laughs> it's not a color I've worn. Look at this. I love that metallic thread. I, I do okay with mustard, so like looking at it. But like, there's a quilt that has some really bright yellows in it, and I can't. Like, it makes me feel anxious. I like well, see, can't. This one has just a few little yellows. Yeah, and this is okay because there's lots of blue. Lots of blue. And mm -hmm. Blue makes you happy. I know. Look at this lovely use of blue, everyone. So much lovely blue and all the point in this to quilt. Point quilting on that. Oh yes. Can you all see the point to points? Also, notice how many of the quilts this year. I want to come over here and get this. Um, this is. Uh, oh, I'm here. I'm just gonna. Oh. Let you read slowly. Counterpoint something or another. But I love the counterpoint quilting. But notice how many of these quilts have been washed. Yeah. I love that. Oh, here's Stephanie Satterwhite again, y'all. You know I love Stephanie. This is this Thornbush. Thornbush. Thornbush by Stephanie Satterwhite. It's beautiful. So lovely. I love the movement of her quilting. It's just kind of Yeah. Random. That's really fun. To what? I mean, it looks. Can y'all see this? 
perhaps Oh, you're so welcome, simple. Cheryl. Deceptively simple. I think probably so. I don't know, it'd be worth asking her if we and spot right her. In here it comes into this, a V. This little V, That's look at that, neat. that she was pivoting. And that means with every line of quilting, she had to swing this beauty around. God bless her. Also, please note the lovely use of navy and orange in this quilt. And the green. <laughs> that, that is an equal opportunity color lover, and I love her for it right now. This is gorgeous. Triangle. Look at this. I love half square triangles. This is Reflection by Sarah Hibbert. I just love these linens. Look at all this. This is not regular quilt cotton. I did this on a domestic or, or a sit down. Yes. It was yeah. Not a, uh, on, but that means that she had to like turn her whole yeah, quilt every time. Quilt backwards. Or quilt backwards. I would turn it, let's be honest. I love this so much, guys. This is <laughs> Isn't this fantastic? It just makes me so happy. Oh, 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 Hooray you know, for Marie Campbell. Yeah, just, yeah, we'll circle back and get it. Okay. I mean, we could include my phone as symbolism of everybody else if we wanted to. <laughs> All the, rock stars, All the rock stars together now. Hey, Nancy. Residual by Christine Yee. Look at all the Look micro at stippling. So much micro everything. And the, again, those accent prints with some solids. I think everyone who works with the white background is the bravest person I know, just for the record. Yeah, there are some. No, those are not solids. Ooh, I gotta pivot, y'all. Look at this. Look at these, so beautiful. This is Sun Showers by Megan Collins. And the dark blue arch. Yes, I love it. I love that pieced arch so much. Again, the excellent use of navy in this quilt. And lavender. And lavender. This is a quilt that all rock stars could love. <laughs> President's Challenge 2018 TMQG. Hey, Nancy. Guys, this is so cool. Is this not like the coolest thing? Look at that. Mm -hmm. I love stripes. Oh, so good. So bold. Now, are they pieced or printed? They are printed. Okay. I go find a piece of that printed fabric yesterday. I like it. Stripe. I like yeah, it a lot. Of the black and white. Mm -hmm. I had to get it in on. Um, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Melissa, you want to come be in the video? Here, just good. say hi. Just say hi right there. This is Melissa. She's the event photographer. You should all love her because all the beautiful pro pictures you see later. Yes. Oh, yes. Follow her. Shameless plug. Beautiful. I also shoot weddings and portraits, and I'm always happy to travel. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> She's your girl. She's your girl. <laughs> Bye, darling. <laughs> Geometry lesson by Jane Willis. I like this a lot. This is interesting because I would guess this is probably all walking foot. It probably says over there if I go read. But just the use of different. Machine quilted on a frame. Oh, so not with a walking foot. But let's, let me just point out you could do it with a walking foot. Yeah. And that would be a great way to add some fun texture at home. Well, Kelly, you have to use rulers. Um, or if you use like that, your edge guide yeah. to do these, you could. But it would take some planning. You'd have to mark a little bit, but it'd be fun. And then Triangle Joy by Carol Lyle Shaw. Guys, I love Carol Lyle Shaw. Look at this. Shazam. Hey, Pat. Oh, yes. Oh, look at it. Okay, Stripey Strips by Patty Kopak. I said that without stumbling too bad. Let's all be excited. Oh, I love this. Love this, love this. Oh, the fish. Look at the fish. Well, not only that, but look at the, the quilting's what I mean. And the, oh, you're looking at the quilting of the like, orange the peel. Out. And then it gets farther apart as it goes out. Farther. So it creates like the yeah. quadrants of an orange peel with the quilting. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm with you now. So Marie, hello dear. But I still really like the fishes as well. Just Ooh. sidebar. <laughs> and these diamonds. Those the cape. Awesome. There's a lot of cape oh, yeah. in here. It looks That's like maybe movement. some tula or something. Some batiks. And then all of these neutrals that are not solid. Yep. Love it. I love it. Round we go. Oh, you're so welcome, Sue Marie. Here's so welcome. Uh, Michael Miller. Oh, yes, the Michael Miller challenge. So this was first place. Uh, yeah. Clockwork by Cynthia Stewart. And there's some hand-stitched details on this that are just stunning. Look at this. I love the ribbons. Aren't the ribbons great? I love them. Individualized for each category. <laughs> I love it so much. 
And then let's see where I saw the here it is these little hand stitch details on here. Okay, yeah. Aren't they lovely? With regular thread. Uh huh. Nice thread. Oh, and pivot. I'm pivoting, guys, for the the piece section again. Piecing. Look at this. This is Weave by Susan Slusser Clay. And guys, notice I haven't pointed this out until now, but look, the, everyone's Instagram handles are on here. So if you're like, dang, I really like that. How do I find that person? Just pause this and jot down their Instagram handle. Okay. Yeah, escape again. Uh, I think I, I moved on. And here is this is Carolina's by Terry Pert. This one's Look again, these bright colors, bright, bright, bright. Happy, happy. It feels kind of improv -y, kind of paper pieced, still blocks. So cool. Hmm? What, those 3D triangles? Hang oh, hang on guys, we gotta go find 3D geese. Oh, I love it so much already. Look at this. Okay, so this is Folded Flyers by Karen Bolin. Oh my gosh, look. They're 3D. They're 3D. I Read want to how like, much extra fabric it takes to make the 3D. 3.2 times as much yardage. Oh my gosh. As the back due to the seam allowance and the folding method. Stunning. Stunning, stunning. I love, I love it. it. I'm going to work my way back up this piece aisle as we go. Oh, you want to finish piece? <sighs> oh, yes. We'll, we'll keep on going. This is... I love these prints as well. <laughs> Modern Movement by Courtney Roshamanesh. I wonder if I got that one right. That felt really brave to say out loud because it's beautiful and I bet I butchered it. This loft is amazing. Line after line. Michelle Settle. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Did you see the one at the far, the, I don't know how many aisles it is, but it's basically like a dresser. It looks like a dresser. Oh, it was a good one. We'll wander over there at some point. That's right, Colette. We're all going to enter. Okay, and this is stunning. <laughs> wow, the laughter over here. I was just gonna affirm her courage, guys. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, so this one. Inspired also, but. <laughs> I love this one, but this one also is a very um, heartbreaking story. Yeah, it's representing all of the children who were separated from their families. I know, right? So it's like stunningly gorgeous, and then you also want to cry. Yeah. Yeah. Again, excellent use of navy. Just gonna point that out. It makes me think of a city. It does. Look, doesn't it look like a city at night? I agree. That's, that's of, what I said, and, and then I walked up and read it. it. When you think about it, you know, the city it's full a, of yeah, it's a city separate. worth of families affected. This one's from Switzerland. Ooh, this one traveled. Lily, by Lisa Hoffman Morer. It's facing, okay. which is all I know to tell you except here. Here, everybody, you can like sneak behind. You can kind of see that, that it wraps, basically. <laughs> Just like shoving my camera behind. <laughs> Don't worry about it, everybody. <laughs> yes, Lynn, I had to go charge my phone. Look at all these lines, how stunning. Roost by Stacey Mayer. All right. Do you want to go find the dresser? Or do you want to do Michael Miller? Okay, Michael Miller. here. Okay, here was where we were. Second place, we did first place a bit back. This is plus sign, oh, hashtag plus sign, hashtag transparency. Excuse me. So many hashtags. Hashtags. With the hash dots. This is the hash dot challenge. So third place is Delta Eclipse by Matthew Wheeler. Which, guys, did you notice how many quilts by men there are in this show? There's a lot. It does. I love it. <laughs> I feel like there's been a really great representation of men in this show, which is really cool. Night Becomes Day by Amy Jerome. Y'all, I'm totally smitten with this. I'm smitten. The texture is killing me. Also, look how delightfully narrow this binding is. That feels, does it feel a little bit extra narrow to you? I feel like it feels courageously narrow. Like, the binding? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, it that, I'm glad I'm not the only one who's thinking that. Yeah. Look at I, this, look at this. And then this nice little, uh -huh. 
That's so cool. Ta da! And here's some more. Here's right. the hash dot yes. like fabric. But like it blends in so, so well it almost looks like a solid, you know? Until you actually get up on it and go, oh. There's something else there's hiding another. in here. Um, I've lost it already. Uh, this one here. Oh, yes, I see it now. I don't know if it's going to show up with the light yeah. on camera, but the orange just... and the aqua and the, ugh. I think I'm going to need to make a quilt in that color palette. What do you guys think? That would All be in awesome. favor? Okay. All in favor, say aye. Aye. <laughs> yes. We've now the voted. Have it. Okay. <laughs> I think we should do a, uh, I think we should do a guild corner? challenge. I also am seeing so much hand quilting that I'm thinking we may have to do some sort of little big stitch. Little big stitch activity. Big stitch. <laughs> this fun. is a uh, corner by <laughs> Stephanie Jacobson and this is Dasher by Cindy Thompson. I, I, excellent, Kimberly. Kimberly votes with us. And Briar Rose by Patty Dudak. I know Patty Dudak. Is that Chanel? There's something no. happened no, going on. Is it just it's like stitching? embroidery stitching? I big think. Big stitch. Like yeah, I said, I think we're gonna like have to do something that yeah, involves some okay. big stitch. Yeah, so if y'all see themes that we need to uh, riff upon once we get back home in the Quilting Rock Stars, feel free to make suggestions. All of y'all. Ooh, I, I like this. Look at this. This is Curve Triangles number two by Margot Yang. And then this is Boxes and Boxes by Patrice Denal. Now that I can do with the quilting. Yeah, I love this. Thinking. It's like puddles. <laughs> Puddle quilting. It's delightful. Also, notice that like... Your switchbacks don't have to be perfect. They can be puddly. I like that. I like that. That's a good description, right? Puddly? That's one I really like. Ooh, I do like this one. This is Synchronized Tears by Erin Andrews. Oh, yeah, it could. I really like those teals together. I do too. Yeah. And I like the... the peach and the gray. I was going to say navy, but I think it might actually be black. Hash dot. It's and the gray. peach. It's gray? Okay. I was projecting my love for navy. Oh, good. Deanna likes the idea of big stitch as well. Ooh, this is really lovely. What is this? This is Hash Dot Sparkle by Karen Winther. And this, I'm going to guess this is by Steph Scardall. It is. Toothpick Bridge by Steph Scardall. She has been so prolific this year, guys. She won Best in Show last year. And she's delightful. I met her yesterday. I love it when people are delightful. It's great. No. Okay, what do we got still? Fabric challenge here. More fabric challenge. Look at this. This is vinyl by Susan Slusser Clay. Look at all different threads. Look at all this. I love those threads. Y'all can even see great challenge. the changing threads yeah. or the curves. Oh, yeah. And look, guys, I told you, you don't have to be perfect. Here's another one. Yes. There's hope for me. And maybe hope for you too, if you're like me, me and you're like, <laughs> perfection, not my jam, thank you. Mountain <laughs> Sunrise by Maureen Logan. That's lovely. That's lovely. It's pretty, no matter what you call it. I wish I had had that idea. That's a great quilt, guys. Ooh, look at this, look at this. I like this a lot. This is Modern Quilter by Patricia Ambergi. Oh, I love it so much. This is cute. And then Isahara by Lynn Hansen, which guys, I haven't showed you the applique section. Maybe we'll have to do it tomorrow because the applique section is very strong this year as even evidenced just by the, look at this, so darling. I love those which, spots. I think I'm gonna have to work on my applique skills, guys. That's what I'm learning. Spring training. Spring Training by Sarah Ruiz Ruiz. from Houston. Holla for Texas. Okay, very good. It's Ruiz. 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 Are you? There we go. I see Ruiz. Ruiz. Gotcha. That was pronounced most of the time. I love the quilt anyway. I don't care how it is. I love it. I love it. That's me too. Oh, okay. Hang on. We're getting. Guys, the cool thing. Okay, hang on. This is Stitched Together by Cindy Carey. We're gonna give her her moment, and then we'll, we'll. Ooh, I like this. I like that oh. they're kind of funky doodled. Yeah. yeah. Don't, I'm very precise in my description of things. Yep. Cuddled, funky doodled, and yep. that this is what they were ooing and awing over, y'all. <laughs> Look at this quilting. So this is pool party. It's called pool party. Is that so perfect that or what? Like By Catherine Rosnowski. And it looks like, looks like a pool down party the, down the river. And 
Yeah. yeah. I think this looks like a rock star pool party. That's what I think it looks like. Mm hmm. That is. And beautiful. here's these feathers for those of you in rock star status who have been learning feathers this week. Nice. Very nice, very nice. Kind of swirly, bumpy, delightful. Oh, and now here is just a oh, big mm -hmm. switch bag. Yeah, really big switch bag. Wow. I love using that kind of filler. Was it? Here, I want to see if it was on the frame or not. It was machine quilted on a frame. So long run. I like how some of the swirls are kind of funky too. Yeah. Nope. It's really awesome. And let's see. Deco Dots by Jen Sorensen. Oh, Sue Marie. That's why we're doing this. So, so that even though you're sitting at your desk in California, you are with us. You have to get close to see the There's dots. So um, yes. Come back here and they read us. And there's the dots, the hash dots. It's solid. It does. It's solid, yes. Again, an excellent use of kind of navy purple. Mm -hmm. I think we finally found a color that all rock stars can love. Look at yes, this. There it is. There we go. We're, sol we're solving our problems one color at a time. Okay. Uh, Sussman by Bridget Dermott over there on the end. And in the middle, we have Interlush by Danielle Gallagher. And happy curves by Rose Daly. Oh, they are very happy. I like them and a look lot. Look at the smiley face. Oh yeah, my God, it is my. It's like a little happy yeah. frog. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a ninja. Oh, or a, a ninja. ninja. Okay. Okay. Oh, and the small quilts. Ooh, look at this. Okay. First place. Will you holler the names at me? <laughs> this one is Catherine Redford. Catherine Redford. And she's in uh, California right now. Oh, delightful. She posted it. And look yeah. at this. You have a good memory, Sue. And then, what's my second place? Sophie uh, Zog. Sophie Zog, Double Sins? Double Sins, yeah. Sins, okay. <laughs> and then... You Are Here by Christine Yee. You Are Here by Christine Yee. Oh, I love that. Look at just the use of quilting in a very... How big would you say that is? Like 18, 18. by 18? I'd guess, yeah. And so much quilting packed into one and again that these are not pieced I love it I love it I love it this is the small quilt section by the way guys yo look at this judge's choice what's this called Log Lunacy by Lori Shelton love lunacy by Lori log. Shelton log lunacy oh that's spot like on log yep cabin. like log cabin that makes more sense than love I mean except for her love of log cabins was definitely slight lunacy After that, you'd hate them. <laughs> that was a tongue. It was because please note that these dark ones are still log cabins. They just have a lot of black in them. And then and we have International Green. Orange. International Orange by Kathy Marker. And this looks like it's a hand dyed fabric, probably. Oh, wow. <laughs> or else it's just the way the light is hitting it. Might it might be, but the color thread or the thread changes is just darling and the cording. Love it. There you go. Okay. There's some more. Yep. See, maybe we need to do something like this. That's blue. Oh, I got a lot. This big set. Who did this one? Mary Kay Waldvogel. Oh. Mary Kay Waldvogel. Waldvogel. Yeah, she's been around for a long time. Oh, nice. And then in the middle, Jane Willis. Jane it's Willis. Block print. block print. Oh, it does look like a block print. I support that. Oh my gosh, guys, the shark! Shark infested shark in waters. waters. Shark infested waters oh by who? Look at the mouth is opening. By Amy Kidd. Guys, that's so fun. <laughs> I love that so much. <laughs> oh, it's not for sale. Darn. <laughs> I need to make a shark quilt. To go with your otters? To go with my otters. Plated by Amy Friend. Plated by Amy Friend. And then salt, pepper, paprika by Lois Christensen. Salt, Pepper, Paprika by Lois Christensen, and... Sunrays Through the Water by Sherry A. Lauren. Sherry A. Lauren, Sunrays Through the Water. Ooh, yeah. Valerie, I don't freeze. Oh, look how sweet this face. is. Self-portrait? Melanie Tuzon. Melanie Tuzon? T-U-A-Z-O-N. T-U-A-Z-O-N. And then we have... Wadsworth by Annie Jeffrey. Wadsworth by Annie Jeffrey? Second one, this one by Annie Jeffrey also. Also oh, Annie Jeffrey? Annie Jeffrey. Annie Jeffrey, okay. And this is Ode to Carmen by Karen Bolin. Lovely, lovely. I don't know who Carmen was. I don't know who Carmen was, but it's a lovely ode to her. Oh, look at here. Ooh, transparency. Ooh. Okay, but what's this transparency one? Okay, that's called Refraction by Yvonne Fuchs. Okay, Refraction by Yvonne Fuchs. And this is Prairie 
Periwinkle Vibration by Kiona Nassan. Periwinkle Vibration by who? N A S O N. Hang on. Ivana. Kiona Nassan. That is gorgeous. Wow. And that darling for the complimentary colors. Wow, wow, wow. Those points make me jumpy. <laughs> Joanne, I don't get all the I don't get all the credit. Be, uh, Bev and Lydia are helping here. <laughs> I have assistance. <laughs> so, single helix by Julie Day. Single helix by Julie Day. Look at all this quilting, guys. I love it so much. I love it. We have, we'll have a virtual tour to keep us company all year long. Couch to 5K by Wanda A. Dobson. <laughs> couch to 5K by Wanda A. Dobson. I love it so much. That's a good way of saying it. Couch to 5K. And Contra Punta by Lisa Lee. Lisa Lee. Lisa Lee. Lisa Lee. Lisa 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 Lisa